We've had so much fun celebrating our 1,000th show this week, and while we've certainly had a great week, the same can't be said for everyone. Oh, no. It's Friday, which means it's time once again to find out who took the biggest L or loss of the week. You voted on our Instagram story, and your results will determine who's spending their weekend on The, the L, L Train. Train. Well, from the train to the plane, our first L train candidate is a man with a cage of recliner rage. Jeez. A woman named Wendy Williams, not the talk show host, oh my God. was on an American Airlines flight when she decided to lean back and recline her seat. Well, that did not sit well with the man behind <laughs> her, who has seen on the video repeatedly punching oh the back gosh. of Wendy's chair over and over again. The incident went viral on social media and started a huge debate over air, airplane reclining rights. <laughs> I didn't know we had those. Okay. Yeah. While yeah. most people Kill thought that the man was rude and out of line, a few others thought Wendy shouldn't have reclined her seat because he didn't have the ability to recline his. Now, Wendy, who claims the airline did nothing to help stop the assault, is now threatening to sue American Airlines mm -hmm. for defamation, telling TMZ the airline blamed her for being disruptive and accused Accused her of starting the whole thing. What? That's crazy. As for who has the right to recline, Delta CEO Ed Bastin uh -huh. really recently weighed in saying that while he believes people do have the right to recline, they should ask permission before doing so. What? what? So, what? has his seat punching passenger yeah, no. punched his ticket We're on the L train this week? We'll soon find out. All right. Uh, this can't be real life. I guess, uh, I've never, have y'all ever heard of that no. before? No. I get it. If you can recline, you can recline. Remind me again why this price of this seat that doesn't recline needs to be charged know. that way. What? Huh? Crazy. What? But also, even if, even if she reclined the seat and she didn't ask or whatever, it still doesn't make him make it okay for him yeah. to treat her he like that. He could. Right? The back of, of the thing. thing. That yeah. would be insane. And, and he could have asked her to yes. put it up. Yes. And What's it, the next one? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We just feel passionate about secret. Yeah, I know. We feel passionate about secret reclination. <laughs> I mean, airplane, no, airplane seats are so expensive. They're so expensive, and some of those flights are really long. You can't expect somebody for, to fly across country for six hours. And people have, you know, Sweet. different conditions where they just need to relax and be able yeah. to stretch their feet. People are at different heights. You've got to be able to recline clearly in the seat. I don't, think that, air, I don't think that was a long, a long flight. But anyway. Sure, but still, you've got to be able to. It's the moral. Well, our next L train candidate I can't. was also flying high, just not in a plane. NBC4 LA recently reported on a suspected drunk driver who decided to take her car to new heights. Footage shows the woman driving her BMW 100 miles per hour in Long Beach oh, before God. crashing into a roundabout, sending the car Whoa! Whoa! sending the car into the sky oh. and debris and boulders crashing into nearby oh, vehicles. God. And while the crash looked bad, believe it or not, driver was just fine, y'all. Lucky. Witnesses say the woman simply got out the car, sat down on the road and asked. What happened? Mm. Well, wow. what did end up happening is she got arrested by police Good. and was held on $30,000 bail. And while, wow. while no one was injured in the scary stunt, the same can't be said for the woman's BMW. Wow. So will this high flyer be setting on the L train this week? Let's Ooh. find out. Oh my God. Yo, as whack as the other one was, this, no, is, this, this yeah, woman could have killed someone. Yeah. Including, Including herself. herself. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yes. Including herself. Jinx. Okay. Are you ready to find out who's riding the L train? Will it be the airplane assault or will it be the woman who flew off the asphalt? Audience, who do you think it should be? Oh. Airplane or the car? The, the car. car. To, to pick between these four. It's saying the car. The yeah, car. The yes. car could have killed somebody. somebody. Yeah. All right, let's see who you chose. I vote every time. Fifty-three percent of you. I thought that would be higher. higher Fifty-three percent yeah. of you voted for her. So I'm sorry, but it looks like the only place you'll be cruising is on the L train. She can't drive.